Hello and welcome to another educational video about Icelandic culture. Today's topic is swimming pools. There are many swimming pools in Iceland. In fact, there are more pools than people. And amazingly, they all have long opening hours from 6 in the morning until 10 in the evening. This is where families or friends gather, like a third place, and also where you take your partner for a second date. It's not awkward, as the ice was already broken on the first date, when you had sex. The cultural swimming pools do not include the Blue Lagoon, Sky Lagoon, or Secret Lagoon. Those are tourist traps that are nine times more expensive than normal pools, and don't even have water slides. Every swimming pool in Iceland is unique and has its own charm, so you can tell a lot about someone's personality by which swimming pool is their favorite. For example, if someone's favorite pool is Árbæjarlöin, then that's a telltale sign that they are a masochist, as that is the only pool in Iceland with a hot tub literally called hell. Although every pool layout is different, there is a basic shared composition between them, and that is two hot tubs, one medium and one infernal, a 25 meter race track and a kiddie pool, and if you're lucky, a water slide. Each of the areas has a special function. The race track is exclusively used for exercise, and the average age of this section of the pool is around 87 years old. The hot tubs serve the unique purpose that it is the only place in Iceland where it's okay to be racist. It's not only welcome, but encouraged. But it's different from your American racism. Icelanders have never seen black people or managed to colonize another country. The kitty pool area is used by young adults as an intermediary stage and serves two different functions. On the way in, it is used as a meeting place while you wait for your friends. And on the way out, it is used to wait out a boner before getting out of the pool. If pools in Iceland sound exciting to you, then you need to know that there is a simple prerequisite to enter the pool. Just one simple rule aside from the entry fee of $7. You have to wash your body while fully naked. The reason for this is unknown, but I believe it's so that the janitor can perform a quick and easy STD check. I cannot stress enough how mandatory this is. If you absolutely cannot follow this rule due to fear of being naked in front of strangers, then you're probably better off visiting one of the following countries instead because that's where it's legal to get euthanasia.